some guy named Stan Lee. What? Spider-Man? Uh, Pam, hold my calls for a while. I, I think I've finally gone crazy. You know, Spidey, I've always wanted to experience real web-slinging. And I've always wanted to be appreciated as a real hero. It seems you've made me into one. Thanks. Hey. You, um, looking at that couple inside? Actually, I was just looking at this, uh, little pink number over here. Oh, yeah, that's kind of nice. They look happy, don't they? You know, it reminds me of an issue of Spider-Man I did when Peter Parker and Gwen Stacy went lingerie shopping. Of course, the Green Goblin showed up, and he pumpkin-bombed the hell out of the place. But aside from that, it, it's pretty much the same thing. Oh, my God. Holy shit! Aren't you? Oh, Stanley. Hi. Welcome back to the Baxter, Dr. Richards. I've got the usual for you. Good to have you back, sir. Thanks, Willie. I guess one person can make a difference. Enough said. Uh, invitation, sir. Um, I should be on that list. Name? Stanley. Yeah, uh, nice try, buddy. Nice no, no, try. really, I'm nice Stanley. Yeah. Hey, Tony. Remember me? Sure don't. Look great, half. For gamma sickness, Milwaukee. A man drank one of those Garana sodas. Guess it had a little more kick than he was looking for. Wow. Where was it bottled? Puerto Verde. Larry. Hey, the Oracle of Oracle. What a pleasure. Nice to see you. King. Larry! Oh. Did it work? <laughs> Captain, that's your cue. I thought he'd be taller. Superheroes in New York? Give me a break. These so This is probably nothing. What? Are your pulses pounding? Can you feel its eyes upon you? The dweller in the dark is watching. Thanks, Harry. It's just Stan. One more time. Bridge, everybody. All right. And all the other worlds would just pass us by. It's beautiful. It's simple. Any questions? Yeah. Can I have my shoe back? All Mom ever wanted was your love. To be with you on our two-story Victorian home in the Cotswolds. But could you even give her a moment? 
What with your banking job requiring you to travel to the States from Tuesday to Saturday every other week? No! I'm terribly sorry about your loss, dear. As for you, now is your chance to do better. Why don't you see that you take it? Thank you, sir. Let's go. Wear that? No. If you're gonna fight a war, you gotta wear a uniform. I am so fired. Ooh, it's not cool to get help. Walk by yourself, you little gargoyle. Look at Mr. Smiles over here. Where's your wife, old man? What a class A prefer. <laughs> Fred. Son. Dad. I wear them front. I wear them back. I, I go, go inside, inside out. out. Then, then I go, I go front, front and, and back. back. Dad! Alexis Ortiz. See this? This was aged for a thousand years. The barrels built from the wreck of Grunhill's fleet is not meant for mortal men. Neither was Omaha Beach, Blondie. Stop trying to scare us. Come on. All right. Egg shell Hey. Could I borrow the sports section? Thank you. I'm fine, right? The bartenders are all like, yeah, crazy stupid fine. Coming onto our stage right now. Give it up for chastity. Uh, you okay? Oh, yeah. Are you Tony Stank? Yes, this is this is Tony Stank. Is hilarious. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Or... Wow, nice suit. Zip it, Stanley. Oh man. Anyway, before I was so rudely interrupted, at that time I was a Federal Express man. Hey, fellas. Hey, wait. Where are you going? Hey, you were supposed to be my lift home. How will I get out of here? Hey, oh, gee, I've got so many more stories to tell. Ah, oh, guys, oh, gee. They're the greatest stories ever told. Heroes show us we don't need to be perfect hey! to do what's right. It's not about living without fear, but facing injustice. It's not about being powerful, but finding your calling when you least expect it. They show us it's okay to be vulnerable, no matter how tough you are. Because even though they're heroes, they're still human. Come down there, you punk. Hey, Gary! How you doing? Marjorie, how are you? How's your mother? Now, don't you move. My hands aren't as steady as they used to be. By Odin's beard, you shall not cut my hair, lest you feel the wrath of the mighty Thor. Please, kind sir, do not cut my hair. 